Oh boy, guess who just sat through that long ass loading screen? Me. I'm probably gonna take a drink. I have plenty of time. Uh, yeah, hey guys, welcome back to the land of frame rate issues. I should let this land. Uh, is I gonna say land of pain? It's the alien cube. That, 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 that's, a different, that's a different game! Sorry, I was leaning in too close to the mic. I had to push it back a bit. Alright, everything seems to be loaded. Let's go. Uh, I also forgot to move this to an SSD. My bad. But I suffered for it, so it's okay. Oh, we can sprint. I was woefully unaware. Alright, there's a padlock on there. The engine's still warm. Someone got here before me. I mustn't get caught. Why would they take this truck? Alright. There's probably only two of them, so that's cool. There we go. Is there going to be like some like omnipresent force that chases me throughout this game too? What does that say? Good thing I can't read. My grandfather's property should be behind that old building over there. Which one? Which old building are you referring to? Hey, that was fucking loud. Oh my god. Ooh, that was painful to the ears. Oh yeah, I did say I would do this, but I can do it now. Okay. That should be a bit better. Oh my head, what's happened? Did I have an hallucination? Perhaps. If you can push a tree down like this, you probably don't want to walk on it. This is not... whatever. Oh. <laughs> okay. Let's try this again. I'm not even gonna look down. I should have looked down. No, I'm not gonna look down. I can do this. Don't die. Don't die. Okay, sweet. Well, skill, no, uh, no luck. Actually, pure luck, only luck. What is this? Oh, I thought that was something important, but I think it's just a rock with weird light. Fuck. Shit. <laughs> Stuck for a second. Fuck that rock. Kind of want to go look at that ominous tree over there, but I I don't know if I can get back up here. If I do, whatever. Oh well. I can just jump off. Right. Look at this tree. It looks like a face. Oh god. Is it a face? Can I just die? I believe I might be able to do that. Oh god! Ah. Alright. Good to know. At least it's not an invisible wall everywhere, so that's cool. I'm grateful for that. But I do hope there's no platforming. Hmm. This looks inviting. Okay.
Okay. Am I gonna try to jump over there and fall immediately? Whoa. A genius that I am. I'm also gonna turn this down in Myers a bit. I heard a voice over there, so I'm gonna run towards the darkness. The dark green mist is always safer. Alrighty. There's nothing I can do. The power is out. There's no fuel in the generator. That's a lot of dynamite. Alright, I guess we're going back towards the voice. Let's hope I don't get chased, because I'm going to get scared. Uh-oh. Do we go left, or do we go right? I think we go left first. Because the light is here first. That's inviting. I can't see. I die. Okay, I just saved, so that's... That's a good sign of me dying. This place is full of secrets. We're all excited. I'm not. At night, we observe the sky and those mysterious lights. While during day, we explore these magnificent tunnels. Why don't you explore the tunnels at night? Whatever. The whole area is full of these underground galleries. It will take us days and days to explore them. They're full of inestimable... What? Inestimable value. Whatever. Fuck you. Fuck that word. Who knows what kind of ancient discoveries we might find deeper inside. It's said that there were ancient underground cities here, connected to each other by a network of tunnels that were populated by obscure cults. In recent history, however, no human being has ever gone into the depths to confirm this bizarre theory. The tunnels are very dangerous indeed, as they could collapse at any moment, not to mention the risk of falling into one of those ravines. Rosa scared me when she said that she heard a strange voice coming from the depths of the abyss. Who knows what she really heard, but it was probably just a poor animal that had fallen down there. Was that poor animal speaking English? Let's go. There's a... Why would they put a light down there? What psychopaths? Is there like a weird, like, lines on here? I'm looking at OBS and I see it on there too, but is, this, is that my vision? Is my vision fucked right now? Maybe. What if it's burned in through the fucking game? Oh god. Oh dearie me. It's just me. Wait. I gotta go this way. Wait, do I gotta go this way? Sorry, I was looking at the fucking... The lines! Oh, I uh, just all right. Perhaps I find fuel somewhere. All right, something green over here. Is it a secret? All right, well, that's normal. When I read on the reviews, this game's pretty short. I think the other one was quite short as well. I just either didn't make as long of Let's Plays or I was just too scared. I don't remember it being that scary. I do remember, uh... I do remember taking my headphones off to get through the water segment, though. Okay, well that's cool. That's uh that's very different than what I see, but telescopes I suppose. Alright, we have fuel. We could Speaking of water Oh, it's a dead person. I don't like how I can go under the water. I was not expecting that, and I disapprove of it. 
I'm assuming I'm gonna have to go through some more water, but at this point, I f fuck me, I guess. <laughs> fuck me. Who cares? I I'll just go through the fucking water. Fuck you. Fuck me. Fuck this. Fuck it. Fuck it. I knew something was gonna happen because my character started running weird. And by running weird, I mean he stopped and started waddling. I don't know why I went this way. I'm still waiting to get chased by something. I feel like it's coming and I don't want it. It just sounds like piss. What's that over there? Oh, I thought there was a person standing there. I was just gonna die, I guess. The power's out. Oh, yeah. My bad. Okay. Alright, fuck you. Let's keep getting hurt in this goddamn game. Oh, am I going to go further down into the cave? I'm going to go further down into the cave, aren't I? I could probably make this jump. I made this jump. Oh! I didn't realize that was going to happen. Ow! I guess the fire in the dynamite wreck next to it was probably not the best, uh, best thing to, to do with that. I should run. Or I'll die. Uh, I might just die. I don't know if I should stop. I think everything's okay now. There's a little forest fire. Oh my god, the way he runs. <laughs> Beautiful. Alright, let me push another log across. What the hell happened over there? Who was that guy? That was a guy. Oh, maybe I don't need to push. Ow. Maybe I did need to push. I'm fine. Stop being a wussy. Uh, it's getting hard to actually move forward. Like, I'm, I'm holding W. Is this because of my injury? Okay, should I stop for a second or what? Oh, God, I'm not touching anything now. Oh, I don't like this. Alright, hold shift and W. And that, that helps a bit. Um, was there a... Was there a better way to do that? It's locked. Damn. I have to find a way to get past the fence. I hope that in that building there's something I can use to heal myself. Oh, okay. Why don't we go along the outskirts of this wall? Yeah, down here. Don't worry, you're fine. Just don't fall off and get us killed. I say as I'm your parasite. The Maxim. Uh, is this going to hurt me even more? Maybe, we, you know, does our character realize we can, like, climb? We don't need to jump off everything. All right, let's craft a bandage. Perhaps. A, I was gonna say, is there a toilet on the other side of that chain link fence? Medicine cabinet. First aid. All right, thank you. That's a little. That's getting a little annoying. 
Everything I need in my leg is better now. Oh, sweet. Who lit, who lit these fires? The precipice from outside. I'll drink to that. I do love this podcast. It's one of my favorites, actually. All right. A lot of useful information off of that. I think we can all take something from that. And, uh, yeah, beautiful. Uh, what's this? What the hell is inside those containers? I don't fucking know. We have so little knowledge of the world around us. The visions of the sacred places have finally begun. The distorted reality they reveal is extremely fascinating. But, uh, what I, ex what I experienced real, or was it in my head? Uh, I could feel clearly that my body was there and that it was a part of that place. Next time I'll record everything with my voice recorder. I want to be absolutely sure that what I experienced wasn't just a vision. This sacred artifact ha has unimaginable power. I was lucky to find it while I was alone. I would be insane to let the other members get a hold of it now. No one must know. This is from Grandfather Williams' journal. You know, if we die, it's kind of deserved. We were told not to do what we're doing now, but at the same time, you get dumped by your girlfriend, right? And you do stupid things. Okay. Uh, let me check the door first. It's locked. Alright. Okay. Uh, if I manage to break them, maybe to open the passage. Well, am I going to break them or not? I could kick those boards. I mean, we pushed a tree down. We can kick a board. Is there an axe in here? Is there a tool of some sort in here? Just want to make sure it wasn't a different page. I don't see a fucking tool. I see a fucking tool. Be really great if you could let me see the axe. Be really great if you can let me swing the axe. It'd be really great if we just didn't leave the axe somewhere and took it with us. Because we're dealing with otherworldly shit and cultists who probably know we're here based off the explosion in that little mine shaft. Would be a bit crazy. I know. A little, a little insane. No, that was a locked door, wasn't it? I don't think we care about that now. Saving. I'm dead. Oh, goody, a page. I gotta yawn. <sighs> Fuck. It's all true. I managed to record everything. This is the confirmation I was looking for. I never imagined I would one day be walking right there, in the outside. That place is beyond description. There's one thing I shouldn't underestimate, though. If I can see, I can be seen too. Next time, I'll have to tread very carefully if I want to go deeper. Something must have noticed my presence. During the exploration, I sensed a dreadful, malign presence and uh, that I still can't explain. That gaze. I can still feel it upon me even now while I'm writing this journal. My foot's falling asleep. I need to reposition. All right, cool. 
I feel like when I sit on my leg, it's like the most comfy spot up until uh, I start to feel that tickle. You know that numb tickle you get? Yeah, that tickle. I'm also just going to be saying random gibberish because uh, death is looming around these caves and so is ASMR. Uh, so there's that. You think that's the alien cube? The one we've heard so much about? This place probably smells weird. Well, my god, my head. What's happened to me? Did I faint? I have to take this strange object out of here and study it in the light. There's light. We, we are the light. I hate these stairs. Gross. Is this when I get chased? You know what's weird? When I play Amanda the Adventure, it becomes an hour and it feels like 20 minutes. For this game, it's been 20 minutes, but it feels like an hour. Nothing wrong with that, per se. Just a little weird. Oh, how kind. It's already nighttime. How is that possible? It must have been there for many hours. I'd better pack, uh, get. Go back to Uncle Edgar's apartment. I'll be able to study the cube there. How the fuck do I go back? I don't fucking know how to leave this place. What's that? What's that red star up there? It's, oh, that, oh, it's not a star at all. I was gonna make a Jill joke. Oh my God, you got it again. All right, all right, all right. I'm good. I'm good. I'm just not I'm not tired. I'm not really tired. My mind's awake, my body's asleep though. Uh Oh wait, is this where I came from? I assume we do go back to the apartment because there's still more stuff to do there. But isn't it a very long drive back to the apartment? Oh well. Where's my car? Well, I don't know. Where's my car? Maybe we parked further up here and we didn't notice. Why is everything so grainy now? Was it this grainy before? I don't remember it being this grainy before. I also have no idea how to get the fuck to that house. Let me check my journal. This object is the same thing I saw in my dreams. How is that possible? I feel a strong and constant call coming from it. Something inside is calling me. Yod. Oh, fuck. What really happened in that cave? I never felt anything so intense in my whole life. I must, uh, must have been out for many hours. It's already nighttime. I've also experienced strange visions, which are getting worse. My god, am I going crazy? I have to find out more about this object. Yes, we are going crazy. But that's okay. Crazy's cool. Cool is crazy. Are we getting hurt? Did we get struck by lightning? What is this? Jump. I could have swore this heavy grain filter wasn't on here before. And it's quite strong. Alright. Fuck that door. Oh, 
Oh, it's just like the original monster that chased me, isn't it? I can't really see anything, though. But I'm assuming it's just like the original monster. I don't really want to die because my eyes are starting to hurt from this. I'd rather not have to repeat it. What the fuck? Oh, I'm dead. Oh, hey, there's my car. My car? How come it wasn't here before? Was everything even real? I don't understand what's happening to me. I must go back to Ezra's apartment and learn more about this strange artifact. Oh god, no, not another loading screen, please. Chapter 4, back at Edgar's. I guess I can read this while this loads. The members of the Order are everywhere, and now they know I'm in possession of the cube. I'm lucky to have found it before they did. From now on, I must be careful. These people are fanatical, and I mustn't allow them to catch me. I'm sure I'll have more information at Edgar's apartment. I hope it's safe there. It wasn't last time. It sure as fuck wasn't last time. What a... We went there and took the thing that they were probably looking for. I'm sure it's safe now. I mean, we just, you know, we just took, we just took from them. Sure, what could go wrong? Checking Reddit. Okay, well, hey, that only took a while. I'll wait for this apartment complex to uh, load in. Before I start looking for clues in the apartment, I have to find a safe place to hide the cube. What about in here? I'm not reading that. I am not reading that. Bro, how do you hide this fucking thing? It's <laughs> it's so goddamn bright. Where the fuck would I even hide it? In a fucking up there with one of the bulbs? There's no reason to go this way. Fuck you. This place is gross. Ah, got a scratch. Alright, good to go. I'll have the cube in here until I do my research in Edgar's apartment. Might find the answers I've been looking for in there. Alright, sure. Whoa. What the fuck do I use as a light source? I can't see shit.
Is there a jump scare? I was trying to use I was trying to use the light from the window as like a guide. Alrighty, can we close that for safety purposes? Okay, so doesn't work. Phenomenal. I feel something strange when I get near this mirror. Um, what do I need to do now? That's cool. I don't think I need to go through the hole. Uh... Trap door is locked. Dude, I can't see shit. They're gonna fuck with me with the lights. Give me a light source, man. I think I already opened that. Someone went through the books, they weren't on the floor before. I don't give a fuck about the books. Oh, fuck me. <sighs> Dude, I'm being attacked by yawning. Alright, let me turn on the lights. There you go. Uh oh. Well, at least those are staying on. Someone took the back off the remote. It's a little fucked up. Uh, someone's been here while I was out. Okay, well, fucking... No phone line. Did I read these before? Or are these new? I don't I don't fucking know. What is that? Is that a page? I don't fucking Let's squeeze through. That door just closed. October 30th, the disappearance of William's son, Edgar Mitchell, caused us quite a few problems. It's been hard to keep track of every officer, but fortunately... Wait, I, I already read this, didn't I? Yeah. Okay, that. That picture. That. That. Okay. But didn't I need to slide something under that picture? It's locked. It's open. Okay, was this area not accessible before? That's cool. Who's there? Okay, that did, uh, that did something.
Uh, okay. Wow. There's a lever here. <gasps> I'm not going to talk about this door. Is that place really my father's secret hideout? It's difficult to believe, but everything suggests it was. I tried to bring as many things as I could with me to examine them here in my study. Many of his notes are written in a language that I don't know. However, this is his handwriting, I'm sure. Those bizarre photos did nothing more than lead me to ask more question. Uh, those landscapes are so surreal, and what the hell are those huge structures in the distance? Looks like my father was doing research into ancient artifacts, uh, and its connection to some mysterious places populated by some sort of horrible beings. What does this all mean? What is he really working on? In the shed, there were some strange statuettes and old cassettes too. I brought them to study them. There's someone in the apartment. The closet, I can hide. Is that a dog? Is it safe to come out? I don't give a fuck. Oh shit, were they up there? I can go there now. Oh. My bad. This strange contraption is the most mysterious object that I took from my father's secret hideout. What's its function? It seems that it allows creation of a small magnetic field, but something's missing for sure. There was an ancient metal door near the hideout, but I wasn't able to open it. It may lead deep into the mountain, and what I need is probably there right now. The whole area is full of tunnels and old galleries. People say that in those mountains there's a huge web of underground passages that stretch for miles. But uh, now that I think of it, the family cabin is not very far from that place. It's right at the top of the mountain. What if somehow everything's connected by the tunnels? There are more of them around there? First of all, I should go to the cabin and check it out. I'll leave early in the morning. That's that's a cabin in the woods. That cabin is in the woods. Uh, what strange machinery? What if I place a cube here? Do I need to go get the cube? I can't see shit.
There we go. What could this be? Wonderful. Juan Differis. I don't like that animation. Okay, let me go get the cube, then go back up there and see what's going on. There's something in the trash. No. All right. I think no one saw this. This cube is just ASMR, isn't it? Yeah, those uh those paintings look kinda pricey. God damn it. You saw those lines mo moving, right? Oh, what the hell is this? Seriously, what, what was that? Did I get Vord? Can I officially make the title Alien Vor? Vord by Alien? Vord by Lovecraft Alien? Is that... Can I just keep saying Vor, Vor, Vor? Alright. What's happening to me? Hey man, I don't really know. Uh What are we doing? What's All right. What? what does this mean? The lighting's better. That's what that means. I'm, I'm seeing that water. And I'm not too happy. It's locked looking for me. I don't like the sound coming from here at all. Whatever. What happened? What is this place? Don't like that. Oh my god, am I dreaming? Ugh. 
gonna squeeze on by here. Excuse me. I'm too lazy to walk down there. What's up here? What's that noise? Fire doesn't emit any heat. Okay, well, if I had a light source, I would enjoy that. Alright. Something's missing. Okay, well. Great. Let me just go down here real quick and uh, see what's shaking. Uh, it's saving the game. I'm gonna. Uh oh. Nothing to even look at out there. It's all dark. I think someone just died. Strange substance. It's entering his body. Yeah, you think that's strange? What was that sound? Oh no, but I'm glad we're saying that out loud. Go find out. Oh, fuck. Well, whatever it is, I'm not going to see it kill me, I guess. Uh, who could have built them? I don't fucking know, man. I can't really see shit, though. Was that there before? I don't know. Do I need to use it in here or back in the other area? Well, I think that door's locked. I don't really see a reason to use it here. What was the point of coming back here, though? I don't know. I don't know, it's something I'm going to see a lot during this game. This one does seem to be more uh, varied than its previous game. Like, I think Land of Pain was really just in a dark forest. Well, this one's... Something's missing here? What the fuck does this bar do then, dude? I thought I could put the bar in there and then pull it and... Activate whatever the fuck that is. Is there anything else over here, or is that just death? I think that's just death. Alright, back down here. Let me go in the dark and start clicking. Oh, it's supposed to st stop it. But why? Wait, did that stop the thing from spinning? Okay.
I'm glad I know when I'm getting chased. I win. I was waiting for it to come up here, but I guess it never does. Alright. What is that thing? What sort of creature is this? What were they doing to it? I have to take the lever. Oh well. What can the fuck we just use the other thing? What can we just use the iron bar? <laughs> it's just, it's almost the same image on the bottom right. What's going on in there? Okay, it's saving, so I think that's a I think it's a good point to wrap this one up. Uh, I really don't know where this is going, and I don't know how long it's going to take to get there. So, we'll go ahead and wrap it up, end it here, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye.